Welcome back to another edition of Keaton Free Adventures. Today I am in Maui and I am here at Slappy Cakes Maui to have gluten free pancakes that you can make on the grill yourself. So, if you're new here, welcome. I am Stephanie and I have non celiac gluten sensitivity, which means I can't eat gluten, but I'm okay with cross contamination. So I am going to places looking for gluten-free foods that you can enjoy while on your travels or anywhere that you might be if you need something gluten-free. So let's go check it out. Grill and got my tool, my spatula, some butter, some sides, things that we might need. So we will see when the batter comes, how it tastes. So we got here's the gluten free vegan. So there's the regular buttermilk. I got bananas to go on there, and now uh, we can cook. There's the gluten free, there's the regular. Okay, here we go with the bananas in it. Now it has the butter and the syrup. There's my bite. Of my own made. You can get them pre-made for you. We just chose to make it ourselves this time, but it's good. Mm. They're a little gritty compared to like what buttermilk pancakes would taste like, but the taste is there. The taste is good. Um, the syrup is good. The bananas are good. It's good gluten-free pancakes. For sure. And I think, you know, the, the added benefit that you can make it yourself, and there's so many topping choices and things that you can put in or on top, and all sorts of different varieties of what you might like, a fresh fruit or chocolate and sprinkles and all sorts of things, um, especially for kids, which is fun. Um, and if you're okay with cross-contamination, then you, everybody gets their own little holder, so each person gets one that makes it, that orders pancakes. So if you were all doing the gluten free, then each of you would get your own to make. So the grill takes a little bit of time, so it's not as fast as if it were on the stove in the kitchen. But um, but yeah, overall it's super fun and it tastes really good, and um, I would recommend it. I do have to say though, this place gets busy. We got here pretty early, before 9 a.m. on a Wednesday, 
and our wait was about 17 minutes for two of us. Um, and the people are just rolling in, just more and more people, and people are leaving. They have a bar area that you can sit up there, and then there's middle tables that don't have the grill, so you can just order stuff from the kitchen itself. So um, that's, you know, you have to wait longer for the ones with the grill. But I have to say, as soon as we ordered, maybe three minutes later, the little squirt bottles came out with the batter and our ingredients and we were ready to go. So it, now we're just literally waiting for the things to cook on the griddle for us. But other than that, it was pretty fast service-wise, so that's great. I see a lot of people with drinks and things that look really good, a lot of juices. So um, this place is packed. The next match is cooking on the grill. The first ones were great. I made these ones. Decided to make these ones a little bigger to see how they how they do with the batter. I make pancakes at home, but this batter is a little bit different consistency, and the, the griddle is it's electric, so it's not not used to working with an electric one. So we shall see. I do cook a lot, but this is an art form, I must say. <laughs> I'm getting the hang of it. That was really good. The batter makes about four to six pancakes in the squeeze bottle. So it's a good amount. It's definitely faster if you use the kitchen. But part of the fun, especially if you have kids, part of the fun is making them yourself. So and making them how you want to make them. So um, enjoy the experience. The service was great. And um, overall, overall fun. And the pancakes were pretty good. If you're looking for a good breakfast place on Maui and you're looking for a gluten-free pancake, definitely come here.